platform of democracy watch initiative south that the current attempt to impose leaders on the national assembly is an encroachment on the functions of the legislative hem of government the group says after a one-day colloquium by northern stakeholders and civil society groups certain resolutions were made which include imbibing and holding the principles of democracy by allowing members of the 10th national assembly to elect the leaders without any form of interference from either the executive or political party. Reading the communique to newsman on Sunday, Professor Nasiru Abdul Kadri Dambata emphasized that capacity, character, and competence should take priority above every other consideration during the voting process by members of the 10th National Assembly. We therefore resolve to encourage all contestants to all positions from whatever region, religion, or zone never to relent on their contests and insist on level playing grounds for elections as the only reasonable and acceptable option. We insist in this regard that Abdulaziz Yari and all other contestants to the Senate presidency be given their fair constitutional rights to franchise alongside others from the southern part of the country. The colloquium called on the attention of the president elect to be watchful against political opportunists and respect the rule of law by denouncing any announcement of any preferred candidate for the 10th National Assembly. To call the attention of the president elect, Aswaji Bola Ahmed Tinubu, to be vigilant as to the political opportunists that surround him with the intent of forming another cabal who are behind this scheme aiming to pitch him against his traditional political friends and sections of the country.